Hello everybody, and welcome back to my Stellaris playthrough as the Geki Imperium, the leader of the Greater Geki Empire. Do apologise, we've not had as much of this over the last week. Um, various things real life happening, keeping me busy, as well as an invasion, a vicious invasion of insectoids into my kitchen. My kitchen has been full of ants repeatedly over the last week. Uh, so unfortunately on occasion I've had to be a... Uh, Taking time off to trek down where they're getting in and seal it up and try and clean up and make sure the kitchen is extra, extra, extra tidy at the moment so they've got nowhere to go. I'm still not doing anything with this at the moment. Um, there are some things which I do kind of like the idea of, but I'm, I'm saving up for other things effectively. I do love Voidborn, I do love Arcology, but I'm not doing them just... I say that, I would like to have be able to uh, get Arcology Worlds. Ooh. Mm. I can come back to that when I decide I want to do it. I have also said I'm going to start suit... Uh, there, 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 words failing me, straightening things out a bit, getting everything a little bit more sorted uh, on my nations. Obviously we are... Currently in a vicious war here too, which we're going to slowly push back. Yeah. So the crew clearing toxic kelp. I mean, hmm. Excellent, we've gained an archaeology site here. So we've gained a few archaeology sites, again I'm aware of that, I don't care, that's fine. And we have foreign claims, oh no, how will I possibly survive? Do want to bring this war to an end. Um, I'm not overly worried about the council vote. Not worried here, we're gonna batter them into non existence. Attacking enemy assets. Attacking enemy vessels. Oh, their little fleets. That is ridiculous. We only get two systems if we um, white piece it. Yes, please. Extra minerals is always nice. Attacking enemy assets. Hmm. The real danger here is I've got to actually land troops, don't I? So I'm going to need to start bringing my, um... I'm going to start bringing my, um... My navy... Sorry, my, uh, marine force down. Oh god, I can't even get to that bit easily. All the sanctions I want. Because they just make me more powerful. I have seen some people with millions of power, and I'm not quite sure how they do it, but... Ooh, that's the other thing I do want to do, is make sure I drive them out of my systems as much as possible. Hmm. 
Hmm. Aw, oh, come on, you want to accept it. Where is my uh, navy, actually? You're going to be better used here to start with. fight going on there. Let's jump in and support my allies who are, let's be honest, getting their butts kicked. In fact, they're jumping out. Let's put us up to speed two. The new council has been chosen. It is me. Well, and a few others, but they're not important, guys. Get that fleet, get that fleet at full speed. Do not let them get out of this system. Uh, plantoid ships, they are pretty. Come on, engage. This is where fighter craft are useful because they'd already be engaging. Here we go. Brief incandescent fire as they destroy the enemy fleet. They said we are taking damage, so I may want to get to the point where I do want to consider that. Seeing if that makes a difference to that. Oh, it does. Okay. However, it doesn't give me the system I actually want. No, Kessa. No. Damn them. I'm going to start moving up into these planets because, yeah. Mm. Let's go clear that out. Star system charted. No! It's gonna go through, unfortunately, but that cost. Mm. Trade value is nice, nice, but it's not really worth it. I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of status, want the status quo a lot. War is getting annoying. Mm. 
And they are slowly grinding my fleets down. Oh wow, that fleet is... Heading here. It's now time to bring everything. And it's so we would get Kessar. Right, we're going to push them out of our systems then, and then we're going to wipe peace. Yeah, I don't care. It's a little annoying having somebody from my uh, founder species there, but we can cope. We Star can cope. Charted. Right, so we're going to clear out all of this. Extra research, jump drive. It's a dangerous tech. Uh, useful tech, but. I'm gonna go for the easy ones first. They do potentially lead to other things. I'm not necessarily a fan of jump drive, but it's a great way of avoiding the enemy. Oh, all of their fleets are coming here to die. Why are you not connected in? You look connected into me. go that was weird oh you can connect into that I've got a lot of stations I need to build up along here as well This is just protecting my trade routes effectively, guys. Hmm. That should help around that area. Oh, wow. bring that in order long run but I'm so big my trade routes are sprawling which makes them a pain in the butt actually
strategy secured. Well, Kessa is the important one here because that finishes them off completely. Yes, please. We'll take Cyanic AI. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can just cruise through those systems. Once we bring this war to an end, I'm going to have to uh, set up some decent patrol routes as well. And we're going to mass our fleets actually to take, try and take out that matriarch up there. In fact, that will be the first thing we're going to do after this. We're going to get all my fleets together up there. These guys must realise they are next on my target list too. We're going to start diplomatically bringing in a lot of other people as well. Planetary invasion commenced. Soon. That's going to be beautiful. Ground invasion force has seized a planet. Nice. Construction complete. Soon, soon we will end this, guys, one way or the other. Technology secured. Hmm. Yes, please. I probably won't use that, but it's a nice option to have. What? That's not good for my, um, war, my weight. Uh, da, 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 da. So, um, galactic community members that are not vassals of another empire and are using less than half their naval capacity are in breach of law. Oh, wow, I need to build some ships then. That's doable. There we go. Right. I don't care if I get there. We will accept this for now. Can give these guys that system. as it is technically their original capital and I don't want to deal with it. There we go, right, it is very, very definitely shipbuilding time then. As we move everything to here. Let's go to fleet manager. Because I can add more to all of this now, can't I? Nice. Reinforce. Receiving communications. Uh, ooh. Hang on, hang on, hang on. They are... We need military soldier. Ozda has requested to become our vassal. Where are these guys? Where are they?
Yes! I agree! And who were the other guys? These guys were uh, really friends with us, weren't they? God damn it, they don't like the guys I just brought in. Oh, typical! So we're going to start working on my using up all that lovely, lovely fleet power as quickly as we can. That'll do. So we're going to stop ourselves being in breach of galactic law fairly quickly, I hope, anyway. You're going to head back to our capital. It's so annoying. Uh, they're also at war with someone. Is there anybody else like that I can bring in? Hmm. Probably not them, because they are very anti. Can't believe I'm in ble breach of my galactic law, guys. Which means I'm being sanctioned, which is not good. It's not terrible, it's just not good. I should be able to bring all that complete. in line. As time goes on, anyway. I'm happy to let these guys expand into their former space, actually, because, well, there's real no real negative to it for me. We now control a good third the... Uh, in, hmm, remarkable. We are now in control of a good third of the galaxy here, which is, is it quite good. Um, if I say that, we are I might push that into the negatives. Once this ticks over, we will be immense. Right, let's have a look at my contacts. Who likes me? Isn't already part of the goddamn Federation. Where do you live? Sound staff, some of these tiny factions aren't necessarily worth bringing in. However... Ooh. Yeah, some of them give me a good reason to go to war with Here's other factions. Oh. 
I mean, long run, we're just going to integrate them, so. <coughs> Aww. But yeah, a lot of these little guys, I might start bringing in guys to, to offer our protection, obviously. You know, because the, the galaxy is a scary place and they are definitely worthy of being protected um, from the aggressors around them. It is interesting to see the other federations. Which are all far smaller than me. Star system charted. Technology secured. Oh, stealing my people. I don't want the extra hook fleet at the moment because I'm trying to... There you go, we're not definitely not in breach of galactic law anymore, which is nice. We might be after fighting the battle up here, but we'll see. One would hope that, that we will have enough firepower there to deal with pretty much anything. The real danger is we are so spread out that if major, major things, when the end game crisis has happened or if the L gates open, we've got potential for a lot of danger. There are a lot of things to hit us at once, um, which could be painful. Technology secured. Mm -hmm. Integrating that little one. Interesting. Uh, let's get rid of some more blockers, though. Let's have a look at my star systems a bit, please. Okay, I'll, I'll come back to that in a bit because I'm a bit skint just now. We've got unemployment on Gekia, that's hardly surprising. Let's go up to speed three for now. As my fleets position themselves. Curious. I've not dealt with this one before. Yeah, but we will soon. And I can't be bothered dealing with the enigmatic fortress. It would be nice to have a way through there, but it's just, just a pain. There is a way of finishing the quest, but I'm not good at it. Basically, I can't remember the exact way to do it. Technology secured. Oh, yes, please. Let's give a dark matter resource. Star system charted. To be fair, I'll kick the Olivers out, get them in, then relight them. It's a bit of a naughty, cheese way of doing it, but should be able to bring these guys in as well in the long run. They're already associated with somebody else, which is problematic, but... Ministry of Protection, please. Yeah, they don't like a lot of people. But to be fair, by the time we get there, we're going to be so powerful, it's not really going to matter. So, 
Oh yeah, our newbie is also in here, even though they are... Oh, actually not! They're, considering they're a single system, they're quite valid again. These guys never got... managed to expand. Technology secured. Whereas some of the other guys managed to actually properly expand. Complete. Ooh! Uh, so passive is research speed, active effect, 50% uh, on a random tech. I didn't actually mean to click it, but no, that's quite nice. You can trade these for an absolute fortune as well. Um, I like that extra research speed actually. Yeah, we're good. Construction complete. That's too much to uh, to not get hold of. back to that. I don't want to do it yet. Okay, guys. Let's do this. Dropping the entire massed Gekian Geki Empire fleet into the system to engage the matriarch. This is on. Oh. Here they come. Obviously, Federation fleets, I'm not, I should have dropped Federation fleets in first. They're big, the big hitters are going to start joining in soon. Yeah, we got it. Our victorious fleet circles the dying Tianki matriarch, her glowing flesh scored by countless blast mark. The violent thrashing of her tentacles still trying to grasp at nearby ships. First slows, then draws abruptly to an end. At last she expires, the ancient matriarch laid to an end. Like her would-be hunters before us. At last! Or so it seemed, our fleet captains are reporting a strange movement coming from within the belly of the beat. Something is about to emerge. Battle stations! A mysterious vessel covered in fluids and damaged by digestive juices blast its way out of the corpse of fallen Tianki matriarch. Our fleet stands ready, but the ship immediately powers down weapons. Its weapons and emerge energies after emerging. They are hailing us. On screen! Oh, from the belly of the beat, this is Captain Ref Odon of the A.H. Uh, I've long suffered in the caustic bowels decades ago. I came to hunt it to repair debt. Interesting. Welcome aboard! You guys can merge please! You can straight up just be disbanded if I'm honest.
Oh, it is a battleship. No, I, I don't want to have to deal with you, if I'm honest. Okay. Nice. I need a science ship here. Uh, where's the next beast to take? Hmm. All to here next. <laughs> I'm now over fleet caps, they can't complain. God damn, finish your war. Technology secured. Let's start gaining some L gate inside. Yes, please, I want the AI. Processing chain, set food, places. I want to get here explored so we can access those Gaia worlds. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that, guys, is where we're going to end it today. So we're now going to hunt the beasts while we just get ourselves in order. We're slowly going to try and diplomatically get a few more in. But I'm, I'm happy with the state of the galaxy here. We are definitely ascendant at the moment. We are heading in the right way. Once we bring these guys in, we will control a substantial chunk of the galaxy. I'm probably going to get everything together to wipe these guys out soon, but I suspect... Or forcibly integrate them. I suspect they are probably trying to get other allies at the moment, but we will definitely uh, bring them in by force, and then it's going to be heading, looking over here again to split up the other federations, guys. And we'll see how it goes, though, anyway. As always, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you have enjoyed this, and please do feel free to pop any comments in the comment section, guys. Cheers for watching.